<laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Hello, I'm Dante Falzone from the Nebraska AIDS Project. They, them, there. What? Me? Wildcats! <laughs> Brad, we need to talk. I'm done with your crap. I'm done with you reading all my texts, monitoring my Twitter and Facebook feeds like a creepy stalker. I'm done with you being so deep in debt constantly spending my money on expensive junk without my input. I'm done with you getting into fights, trying to prove yourself to everyone, and get what you want from people through fear. I'm done with you and your promises, filthy lies, every one of them. You won't listen to me no matter how much I repeat it. I don't want you in my life anymore. I am so sick of feeling like I have to watch myself like you're constantly listening, constantly watching, and just intimidating enough to make me go along with what you say even when I know it isn't right. We're all stuck with Brad. Even those who've never been involved with him have been subject to his influence from birth onwards. Will he never get the hint? Of course, Brad is a narcissist and a sociopath, and we might never escape from Brad. Some people forced to spend so much time with him even grow to be like him, to like him. Brad isn't a real person. We all know Brad. I am, of course, referring to the federal government of the United States of America. <laughs> Claiming to live by an ideal of rule of the people, by the people, for the people. And yet it does all these awful things I didn't ask for. Did you? It's very much like an abusive partner, one who mistreats us and ignores our needs, and with whom we have scarcely any chance of breaking up. Some people think, hey, maybe Brad can be changed. Maybe if we have a talk with him with a firm but reasonable tone, maybe, just maybe, we can change him for the better. Maybe we can make with him a more healthy relationship. Maybe, maybe, I doubt it. I think that Brad isn't likely to change anytime soon. Oh, he'll say he's changed, of course, but it's just another way to manipulate us, another way to lie to us. I sincerely doubt that we can have a healthy relationship with Brad. I don't know how we'll get him out of our lives, but I know that we have to.